The title We Hunt Together refers to the fact that we're dealing with two pairs who are simultaneously hunting, so our killer couple are hunting their victims, and at the same time they are themselves being hunted by our police duo. The themes that run through We Hunt Together that got me very excited about the project is nature and nurture, what makes us the way we are, what defines us. The story is what the story is, but what makes it really special and unique and authentic is the character and the relationship. And you have that in abundance in this show. Baba is a person who grew up in the Congo. Um, he was unfortunate enough to be involved in the child kind of soldier industry, as I like to call it. He then sought refuge, moved to the UK, and spent five years in the UK living under the radar. And that's kind of at the back of where we meet him. He's on the tail end of just trying to live a normal life as normal as he can. And it's at that moment when he, he meets Freddy. I don't think anyone really knows who Freddie is. I think she has a solid idea of what she is and what she believes in. She's described as a free spirit. I think that was in the first breakdown. And I think she is a free spirit, but I think it's more than that. I think she has a set of ideals that are completely alien to most people, but she strongly believes them and she has a way of going about her life. She's incredibly independent and different and funny and unafraid a lot of the time. I'm used to feeling smarter than most people I meet. So you think you're smarter than us? Probably. How do you know? We just met. So Lola Franks has been working in London for many years. She's a DS. And when you meet Lola, she's at a very fragile time in her life. An event happened four years ago that's defined her now. Jackson Mendy, who's her new partner, comes in and shakes things up. And in a way, I believe saves her life. D.I. Jackson Mendy. At the beginning of the story, I would say Jackson has just uh, moved over from internal affairs and is now part of the homicide team. I suppose he's one of these people, he's a bit of an idealist. His father told him that a good way to judge a society is by the conduct of its police officers. And he took that really to heart and joined the police force despite having many options. Carl Tibbetts is the director, the lead director on We Hunt Together, and Jamie Lee Lapsley is the production designer. They've made the most extraordinary thriller, high-concept world. The leading thought or process for me on this was about creating a sort of fantasy world for Freddy and Baba to inhabit, so that the world of Lola and Jackson sits very much in that sort of slightly hyper real world that we've created for Freddy, that then fed into the idea of the noir and that fed into like this idea of North London noir. You know, if you look at her apartment and her flat and the world that she lives in, it's very much kind of like, you know, between the cracks. She's somebody that has just literally slipped through the cracks in society, as has Baba. Okay, so when I first read the script to We Hunt Together, one of the things that appealed to me enormously was that something shocking can happen, but it can, it can happen with a, a great sort of sucker punch of laughter at the same time until you're quite shocked at yourself for laughing at what is essentially a really, really nasty murder. You'll walk into a crime scene and it should be, you know, your cop show. We've kicked all that kind of stuff out the window. We've made it a how it would be. And my son and I, we made you banana bread. We'll uh, eat it in the car. Been warned. I mean, thank you and everything, but... Uh... Are you worried that it's crumbly? It's not, it's deliciously moist. Don't ever use the phrase deliciously moist in front of me again, do you understand? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> yeah, so we, we do go to some quite dark places in terms of the, the violence and the murder. As a writer, you have to think very carefully about those things. I think it serves the themes of the show. We have to test the sympathies of the audience to the extreme by showing the most brutal behavior. And can we show empathy for even these most heinous, violent, dark acts? And I think in order to test that theory, we have to go to some pretty dark places. I think We Hunt Together will encourage debate, definitely amongst viewers. I think it's a good thing to question each of the characters' morals and reasons for doing things. And as I said, everyone in it is flawed to a degree, and everyone in it has had different backgrounds and different starts in life. And I think, again, who's to blame? This show is different because you're dealing with dysfunctional people doing everyday things. It's going to make people question themselves taking life and trying to find life. That's what this show is. Okay, well, I'm gonna go and investigate a murder. 
you going to come? Yes, after you. 